Galaxis here guys with another Castle Clash video and today we're going to be looking at what I did in Arena. Over the weekend I was able to make it up pretty high in Arena and uh, you know just been trying to organize my squad and I got my Aries. Recently got the 5 Revite on my Aries so you know that made me be able to be competitive in the Arena. So uh, what I had to do is I got to be able to get my Aries across the field to the other side quicker than the other Aries because you know there's a lot of guys out there with 5 Revite Aries. The key will be to get your guy across the field quicker. So you can see it took me a lot. I spent about, I guess, 50,000, maybe close to 60,000 red crystals to get this done. So some people may judge that or whatever, but this is something that I wanted to get done. So it took me a lot. You can see now it's taken 6,000 to combine four of those level three crests to make one level four. So, I mean, you know, I'm using a whole lot, but the key is this is gonna help my Aries. I can go ahead and throw that crest set on him and it's just going to make him get across so much faster uh it's going to make a big difference in me being able to win arena battles so check it out got my level four sprint crest 40 percent increased move speed uh you know it's just really really making it a big deal now also i have lightning rock on him so and that's level four so i think it's moving like 30 percent faster so you know he moves pretty fast and you can see this first match um got out there got my aries off but since we went head on, uh, his Skull Knight, you know, his guys just sort of really crushed me. So the idea was, well, I'm going to have to go on another, uh, you know, lane, and that way I can be able to get my guys across. So I realized that I didn't have my Warlock in. He has a five Revite, so I wanted to have him out because he can slow people down. Made a decision to go ahead and put uh, everybody on the middle because I know the Black Devil is running on the bottom. So that's going to allow me to at least be competitive because uh, his Skull Knight, that double evolved Skull Knight, man, he really puts in a lot of work. So you can see what's happening. My guys got off. We are able to slow those guys down. Dread Drake and uh, Warlock was able to hit those guys. Now you see my Ares got over there quick, and that allowed me to disable everybody on that side. My guys are continuing to go, and uh, we're not having a problem. And I don't have Santa Boom in here. Uh, because I'm using Phantom King in place of, uh, you know, my Santa Boom for these. But uh, eventually I actually do make a decision to put Santa Boom in just to be able to knock people out. So here we are taking on another uh, pretty strong guy here, 76 Saya, I think that is. I'm not exactly sure how you say that, but this is what we did. We were able to get over there. You can see his Ares has Sprint and stuff also. So a little bit scary because he was able to get his proc off, but... My guys keep going, and uh, we're just continuing. Look at that. Medusa is hitting hard. Medusa is taking away energy from everybody. I was getting a little bit nervous about this, but check it out. My Ares comes back. He's able to clutch it for me, able to take those guys out, and then we are able to keep going. See, his Ares wasn't able to do anything to stop us. Well, right there at the end, he got a proc off. But we are able to take him out. Medusa, he had an Ares on there, Dread Drake, Skull Knight. So that was pretty cool. I was able to knock them out, and uh, we were on to the next one. As soon as I, you know, had an attempt ready, went ahead and get back in. In order to keep rising, you have to do your attempts as pretty much as soon as you can because you'll get knocked down pretty quick. So you see my Aries got over there quicker, and uh, that sprint is just making the difference for me being able to get over and take these guys out. See, so Aries is continuing to proc, and they're not even getting a chance. You see his guys over there. I zoomed in a little bit just so you can see what's happening. They're not even getting a chance to do anything. So uh, that's, that's really what it comes down to. You know, you got to get over there. Sometimes you might need to put a uh, Berserk Crest set on your Ares even so that he procs a little bit faster if there's another 5 Revite with, you know, the same thing. I've seen everybody have Valentina. I recently got Valentina. So I am going to have to work on her, I think, if I want to go further because you can see everybody has an Evolve Valentina there. But uh, here we are taking on another pretty strong guy here. And you can see what happened there. We were able to slow him down right off the bat with Warlock and Dread Drake. And uh, we got on over there really quick. And uh, my Ares was able to get his proc off. And that's just going to keep. Now, these guys are really strong. You can see that even with my Ares, um, you know, proccing on them and stuff, they were still keeping up, you know, still actually getting close to being able to take us out. But they weren't able to do it. We got uh, 2681 rank out of that. And then here we are taking on Duke and Hammer. 
1681 and this is uh the highest that i've made it actually so the five revite aries with that 40 that uh you know 40 increased speed with the four sprint crest is just amazing you can see my aries stepping out he gets out there already and just quickly disables everybody and uh you know it's just really making a big difference so yeah i did have to drop like you know 50 60 000 red crystals but it's all good i had it and you know it's really really making a big difference in this game mode uh to be able to drop that on my aries and i can throw a war god on them for uh you know guild wars and stuff like that but having a lot of fun being able to drop that sprint crest on them for arena so there you go guys i'll get you some more uh you know arena gameplay so we can go ahead and cover how far we were able to make it there but uh, appreciate everybody checking it out. If you guys have any tips, pointers, go ahead and leave that. Leave me some comments. And uh, keep on clashing. Keep on grinding. We'll catch you guys in the next video. Till next time, Galaxis out.